about things after an easy first set for Mary Pierce. The wave has, uh, it's kind of like bell bottoms. That's the wave is coming that's back. 13 days in a row. <laughs> Trying to keep warm out there. A cool day here in Paris. Thankfully, no rain. And Pacina Martinez is going to regroup or have to regroup here in a hurry. Player going for a lot on the first serve. The shock here is how many unforced errors Martinez has made. Seven winners. She doesn't hit a lot of winners, but you're not going to see a, that many errors normally from her. I mean, Pierce has played reasonable. I mean, she's not playing great, but yet she's still she up six too. She hasn't had to. She, she really has not had to do much. Martinez is really this is rare for her, but just handed her a set. Oh, Nerves playing a big part so far. And playing here. Conchita Martinez will experience what Monica Sells spoke of after the quarters where she said the crowd here makes it difficult to play against a French woman. She said, I understand. I just wish we had that in the United States. I used to say that same thing. <laughs> See, you had I, all I, those night matches I, in New York. Well, I grew had. up 15 minutes away from Flesh and Mass. Come on. I mean, just acting like a, another New Yorker. Gonna be a submarine uh, server soon if this keeps up. I was about to say I can't believe she's getting away with that shot. I mean that's about as low percentage as you're gonna get. And the ball's below the net. We missed that shot, but Mary misses the easier of the two. I mean that's much easier one to deal with. Cheetah's got a couple points to get on the board here in the second. <laughs> well, she certainly made no mistake here. Martinez with the short ball. She steps in, takes it on the rise, and whacks it. Martinez, we know. Boy, Martinez played a good game to open up the second set. Well, two of track and field's greats are here. The world's fastest man, Maurice Green, and 99 world champ, Inger Miller. Bud Collins is between them. Inger, my mother warned me about fast women, but she's a fan of yours. Now, you won the Worlds last year in the 200, gold medal in the relay at the yeah. Olympics in Atlanta. What are your... What are you going to do this year? Well, I'm looking forward to three golds at the Olympics. Three golds? Yes, in the 100 meters, 200 meters, and the 4 by 100 meter relay. What happened to that woman named Jones? <laughs> well, she's out there, and she's amongst a bunch of women that I know are going to be hard competitors for me. Well, Inger's coming at you, Marianne. And this is the world's fastest human. I'm glad we're sitting down. Maurice Green, you didn't make it last time to the Olympics because of an injury. Are you concerned about the trials now? No, I'm not concerned at all. I'm just going to go in and have a lot of fun and make the team like I planned. What kind of a time is it going to take to win a gold medal? Um, I really don't know. I'm just going to go out there and do the best job that I can, and hopefully I'll come home with it. Well, we wish you Godspeed. We'll see you both in Sydney. Thank you. Thank you. And, of course, you'll see them compete, the Olympic track and field trials from Sacramento, California on NBC. It'll be in July after Wimbledon. 
Martinez with the backhand winner. Love 15. Looking to build some momentum here. Someone tell her we're on for three hours. I can't take any more seniors doubles highlights. <laughs> Neither can we. <laughs> See, I set you up for that. Well, we've seen, though, during these two weeks, enough astonishing turns around, turnarounds in matches. It doesn't seem like on the tear by two, John, it takes a, very much to have a swing. Yeah, it, it can't be that easy to win a French Open, is it, for the first time? I'm just going to have to go through, through some further trials and tribulations. Martinez now at love 30. Remember, tennis fans, that part of the net, six inches higher. Conchita knows that full well. Clip the top of the tape there. First signs of nerves really for Mary, and now Conchita, the chance for this early lead, and she could definitely use that boost. So after barely winning points on Pierce's serve in the entire first set, now two break chances for Martinez. shot was amazing there that she tried that little slice backhand that actually worked. Oh, she had the shot that she wanted. Mary Pierce giving her the uh, stare down once again. Don't try that again. Very strange passing shot. Martinez one more break point. of the court by Conchita. Just couldn't win the point. Well, that's all that hustle and hard work. Mary's using those angles beautifully. Martinez hits the nice back, and she's got plenty of time there, but takes her racket back a little too late. You want to take that racket back as you're running. She took it back when she got there and missed that forehand well long. I'm sure fatigue starting to set in. Mary just mad at herself there because she knew Martinez was a little winded. She didn't have to play it that close, and instead she gives Conchita another chance. Third break point of this game. Third double fault, so Conchita Martinez gets the first break of the second set. Well, I got a tip for you. Hey, maybe you ought to look into a little something called Keldar Enterprises. Keldar? Keep that between us. Yeah, uh, a friend of mine is very well connected. You're sure about this? So sure, I already bought 200 shares just this morning. So who do you trust? CNBC.com. Profit from it. returns to San Diego to defend his title at the 6th Annual Quality Challenge. 
battling it out with Jimmy Connors, Pat Cash, and Andres Gomez for $325,000 in prize money. Last year's event was a sellout, so don't miss your chance to see the action July 13th to the 16th at Rancho Bernardo Inn. Call 877-537-MATCH for your tickets to the Quality Challenge. I am a third the size of Alaska, a tiny fraction of the Earth. I crave more goods and services than the entire population of mainland China. I have won more Nobel Prizes than the Soviet Republic, France, or Sweden. I speak 300 languages. My skin is all the colors of the rainbow. I am California. Celebrate 150 years of wild California on the world's largest screen from the producers of Everest. 97 days to Olympics 2000 on NBC 739. We created a smarter kind of investment firm. We also created a smarter kind of investor by Porsche and by Nike. So for the first time, Mary Pierce now has hit a slight bump on the road to what she hopes is a French Open title. Conchita wishes it would have happened in the first set. As you mentioned, John, though, this, this can be replete with breaks of serve. That's a given. I mean, serve is probably the least important stroke in tennis, in, in women's tennis, where it's the most important in men's. Then you throw in the nerves, both players trying to win their first ever French Open, how much it means to the two of them. And I think you could continue to see, see that throughout this match. Sheena Martinez has a fine topspin backhand. Nicely oh, placed, forced Mary Pierce on the run. She's the one that misses the ball badly. To me, she does a lot better when she steps in and tries to take a crack at it. There's always time for defense. goes off. Bell tomorrow. We'll have the conclusion of the French Open presented by BNP Paribas. The men's final, Magnus Norman takes on past champ Gustavo Kertin at 9 a.m. Eastern. It wouldn't have mattered, but Martinez did hear a cell phone go off as she was moving forward. But Mary's drop shot too good there. trying to be more aggressive and put some more tops in on that backhand side floated that one long 30 all and let's see if she breaks right back oh. got to find that middle ground you know, she's gone from slicing all of them to coming over all of them mix it up Keep Mary guessing. Depth, speed, placement. Well, from a 30 love game now, Mary Pierce has a point to break back. And once again, a makeable pass for Conchita. At the very least, make Mary hit that volley. Pierce with plenty of chances already. And then we get a rare peek at the sun today. I mean, that was 
exactly what the doctor ordered because what she did was he started off by hitting a very sh short backhand slice and pulled Mary out wide, forced her to move a long way to her backhand and then the drop shot. That toss is literally a couple inches above her head. Mm -hmm. It seems way too low. Oh, a great backhand. Cross court by Conchita. Look at her serve from that previous point. I was wrong. Actually, got a, got a little bit above her head. But this shot here, I mean, this is big time. That's frustrating to watch go by. Angle of your dreams there. Now a point for three, love. Big game for Martinez here. Oh! Not quite yet. I would imagine, John, that Martina Navratilova still has nightmares about that backhand crossing shot by, or passing shot by Martinez from their Wimbledon final. That's where I first saw it, as a matter of fact, and some uh, excellent volleying ability, you know, where she was able to win some points at the net. That's why Martina is still out there trying to play doubles. Tie Billie Jean King for 20 Wimbledon titles. As she will at Wimbledon. Win a few rounds here at the French Open. tennis there. This will be the new rankings that come out on Monday. And with this event, Mary Pierce ties her all-time best rank. And Conchita Martinez also jumps up into the four spot. Got to get Serena out there playing again. U.S. Open champs drop to eight now. Mary played a beautiful point. Nice backhand volley oh, winner. And it's followed up with a Martinez unforced error. Still hurting her and the crowd pumped up. Great point opportunity again. First serve, 72 miles an hour. <laughs> Placement was right where she wanted it, and then the ball took a bad hop on top of it. Take it easy. She nice. runs around the backhand, see that ball dip well below what Mary expected. How many points do you expect to win in a Grand Slam final with a 60 mile an hour serve? So that's what a, lot, serve a lot, was. a lot, <laughs> because that, that's about what she hits her second serve. Mm. I mean, she's hitting in the 70s, her first serve, maybe occasionally into the 80s. That serve, by the way, was 50 miles an hour. So Mary Pierce hit a good solid return, and we've seen that shot in this match. That two fisted back in up the line for a winner. Wide. 
So Conchita Martinez unable to hold the break. And we're back on serve in the second set of the women's championship. A mere flicker. Once, that was all the hope that remained for the tiger. And while this species is still one of the world's most endangered, hands from all ends of the earth have begun to kindle the fire and breathe life into her flame. We at Exxon Mobil are proud to play a part in this global effort to help keep the tiger's fire burning brightly. To find out how you can make a difference, call 1-800-5-TIGERS. BNP Paribas, a highly diversified bank with worldwide presence and local market expertise, gives investors access to global markets. Discover BNP Paribas, a new force in corporate and investment banking. Boxster-S. Even heaven has its moments of hell. J'avais mon permis. Tous mes formulaires étaient remplis. Et ce type me fait pas arrêter encore 30 minutes. Mais c'est dingue. Alors je dis, je pas ça bien servir un client. Je suis peut-être pas un peu modèle. Ah non, mais tu pourras, tu sais. Mais j'estime que j'ai le droit d'être servi correctement. Excusez-moi. J'ai ma réfère une H.A. Enfin bon, tu vois. Tout ce qu'il faut faire pour avoir un petit bout de papier. BNP Paribas, a highly diversified bank with worldwide presence and local market expertise, gives investors access to global markets. Discover BNP Paribas, a new force in corporate and investment banking. The Lakers, the Pacers, in a hard-nosed game two, Shaq came up big again, leading L.A. to victory with 40 points. But now Larry Bird's Pacers are back home again in Indiana, in front of their loud home crowd. Crucial game three of the NBA Finals, Sunday night, 7 Eastern, 4 Pacific, NBC. French Open Moments, presented by BNP Paribas. Chris Everett arrived at Roland Garros as a teenager and over the years made Court Central her own. Perhaps her most satisfying victory here was in 1985 when she endured a grueling three-setter to win over then number one Martina Navratilova, avenging a loss to her longtime rival the previous year. In all, Everett surpassed the great Suzanne Longlon with a record seven titles here. Well, Bjorn Borg, we've talked about his amazing record. How about Chris? Seven singles titles on this very court. And she only, she also won uh, something like 156 consecutive clay court matches, mm -hmm. which is uh, beyond unheard of. And we'll look forward to having Chris rejoining us at Wimbledon. Yes. Yeah, I think Conchita might should get Chrissy's number, and give her a buzz and say, uh, what should I do here? Just when it looked like she's starting to get some momentum and confidence, she gives the break right back. Was that a warning? That, that, we're getting, that, that we're getting a be, translation. That couldn't be. It sounded like. translation on that and let's go to Bud Collins well that was rather unusual that was a code violation for coaching so obviously it was from Patricia Terabini who is somewhere in the crowd she's not in the players box where we thought she would be but uh, she's over in the Tribune so maybe she thought she could get away with it from there nothing serious Okay, let's take a look. We, we believe we've seen. Ah, there we go. Hit forehand uh, in yeah. the court. <laughs> <laughs> but that, that's going beyond the line. <laughs> Any coaching's yeah. illegal. So. Right. I'm not sure what is a big deal in 
in Bud's uh, mind. But maybe they should, should come out on the court. We saw earlier in this uh, French Open that there was Franco Scolari got a warning on the court. Same thing, coaching violation. Larry Passos, who's Kierton's coach, has been warned, and he's, believe me, he's got uh, some cookie Rojas in him. <laughs> <laughs> I like that reference. And Mary Pierce, once again, has hit the swinging backhand volley for a winner from below what appeared, at least to me, to be below the net. Now two all in the second. John, they've been on the court an hour and six minutes, and Conchita Martinez must feel like she's been serving for an hour and three minutes of it. <laughs> this entire match has been played I, on her serve. I don't think she wants to serve at all, to be honest. Another way that Mary Pierce has improved so much, that backhand. I mean, she was there, she just, she, she bunted it. I mean, she really has more variety in her game than I've ever seen. We've seen some angles. We saw, saw the short backs from the previous point. This time, just a major pop up the line for a winner. in the zone right now. And that back hit up the line is a thing of beauty. And no matter where the ball's hit or where she's standing on the court, she feels like she can hit a winner. Yeah. She took a little slight pit stop early in the set. But now the French fans, Jan Tyriak in the front. He's not a French fan, but <laughs> he's a fan of himself. <laughs> <laughs> well, they've seen Mary win nine straight points. And now three more break chances. Doesn't need three, only needs one as Conchita Martinez throws in a double fall. And now Mary Pierce is up a break in the second set. For years, tigers have been the target of poachers. Killed for their fur and organs. These magnificent creatures have become an endangered species. ExxonMobil is sponsoring a program that protects tigers from poachers. And to judge by its success, things are starting to click. To help, call 1-800-5-TIGERS. And I'd like to say thank you to you, because you like me. Right now, you like me, you like me, you really, really like me. <laughs> Actually, in Missfield, we help a lot of our customers find independent investment advisors. Oh. Huh. If you want a little help managing your portfolio, all you have to do is ask. Sally, we like you. Really, we oh, like can you. can it. To see inside the human heart, a doctor once needed a scalpel. But with ultrasound systems from Agilent Technologies, doctors can now spot problems that once went undetected. And sometimes even fix them without surgery. To see inside the human heart is to sometimes see relief.
When Tom Malchow left home to compete in the 96 Olympics, he gave his parents an Akita puppy so they wouldn't miss him. Tom's U.S. teammates jokingly nicknamed him Puppy Chow. But this young pup surprised with a silver medal in the 200 fly. Now stronger and more experienced, he dreams of gold. The Olympic Games on NBC. Follow the dream. Today's Agilent PowerPoint featuring Mary Pierce. Well, it was Lindsay Davenport, the most powerful woman in the game, but someone's catching up in a hurry. Mary Pierce harnessing her power with some excellent consistency. And in addition to that, able to mix up her game, the angles, the top spin, and that beautiful short backswing on the backhand side is paying dividends right now. And then, of course, we have to see the swinging volley. <laughs> that was that great shot, I think, the other semifinal against Hingis. Cramping, yet still hitting winners. No aces, yet total domination at 6 2 3 2. 0 15. We better call the trainer and get some oil on that shoulder for Conchita because she's having a tough time with that serve. She's okay below the shoulder, but she's got to lift her arm up. Boy. Really struggling today. just way too short and this is easy overhead for Mary Pierce might be just a couple feet past the net that's not going to do it Pierce yeah. trying out those those repaired eyes. She had laser surgery. You can see her well, focusing the ball, this on ball line. is clearly wide, mm -hmm. but Martinez would just prefer that they, if, if by some chance that had been in, she would have been really upset at that umpire because she had a pretty easy winner lined up. When you overrule a call, be sure it's out. Particularly when they're still in the middle of a point. Mary's the first tennis player I've heard of who's had the laser surgery and says it's helped her gain the ability to more clearly see the ball. There's Martina Navratilova. We are 18 slam singles titles, host of doubles as well. And a two-time Roland Garros champ in 82 and 84. Along with Steffi Graf, to me, the two fittest ladies I've ever seen on a tennis court. That Martina is where she wanted her. Got a little tight on that forehand there, trying to close the door here. Surprise, surprise, break point.
Martinez deserved that one, Ted. It was in Martinez. Well, incredible coverage again and scrambling by Conchita Martinez. And we are once again on serve, second set. Now on Mondays, start your week with a bonus Law and Order. NBC Mondays at 9, 8 Central, extra episodes of Law and Order. Order! Oh, this is outside the scope of your authority. Now, Law and Order twice a week. We'll hit them with everything we have. Every Wednesday, and now Mondays at 9, 8 Central on NBC. I like to leave my problems at home when I drive. But if I can't leave them at home, I tell them they can come along. But only if they shut up and enjoy the ride. No one beats Mac in those five times in a row in the finals, baby. Nobody! returns to San Diego to defend his title at the 6th Annual Quality Challenge, battling it out with Jimmy Connors, Pat Cash, and Andres Gomez for $325,000 in prize money. Last year's event was a sellout, so don't miss your chance to see the action July 13th to the 16th at Rancho Bernardo Inn. Call 877-537-MATCH for your tickets to the Quality Challenge. 97 days to Olympics 2000 on NBC 739. The French Open is brought to you by KPMG. KPMG, it's time for clarity. By Aflac, without it, no insurance is complete. And by Tyco International. This is where they should have a rule that as a player, you, once one game a match, you can ask your opponent to serve twice in a row. <laughs> <laughs> New rule in the tennis. Conchita would just like to roll yeah. all the balls down to the other end. Just you keep serving. Yeah, you go ahead. here to hit the second serve. A bit of the tear by two, I think, in her eye. There's another French Open champion, Ely Nastasi. Proudly walking around. Telling everyone how much weight he's lost recently. 30 pounds. Is he true? It, it, it is true. He's, I see you got to start eating sometime. It's not, it's not the exercise. That's when it's dangerous. You got to get out there and get some exercise, too. One here in 73. Once again, Conchita in trouble on her serve. Bad luck here. 15-30. Oh, yes. As a player, do you feel like those are the points you need to win a Grand Slam? Well, she did win one the previous game. It eventually broke. She got a bit of a break on her own leg court. They say those even out as well. 
as well as the calls. I don't know about that, but. Calls off. What you have to do is regroup in a hurry and keep focused despite these unfortunate occurrences, what Conchita at least did there, and hope that your opponent tightens up. She doesn't blow a lot of people off the court, Martinez. to say that's what Mary's got to stay away from making errors off the return because there really is no reason for that but the play is correct isn't it she's up inside the base oh the play is absolutely correct but just play it safe for that first shot even if, even if she hits it to Martinez it's very unlikely she'll hit an outright winner Martinez lost control of it. That damn line. Scattered here throughout the court, It shows you there, Ted, you don't always need power. That was not very powerful, but very well placed. That's what I try to tell these young guys, like, you know, watching Andy Roddick, the junior who lost here in the quarters. If you can do both, you're going to be a whole lot better off. You see a lot of guys hitting with power, even more women. And Kachita Martinez holds. So the Spaniards are trying to rally their hope as we're on serve, second set. BNP Paribas, a highly diversified bank with worldwide presence and local market expertise, gives investors access to global markets. Discover BNP Paribas, a new force in corporate and investment banking. How does Lotrimin AF start curing athletes for? On contact. How does it start to relieve the itching? On contact. How does it help stop the burning? On contact. How does it start killing all three funguses? On contact. Nothing cures better or faster than Lotrimin AF, the number one recommendation of doctors. So if you can't wait to feel better, there's nothing like starting the cure. On contact. Lotrimin AF, the killer cure. My baby don't stand no cheating, my baby. Yes, you don't stand no cheating, my babe. Oh, yes, you don't stand no cheating. Don't stand none of that midnight creeping, my babe. True little baby, my babe. Hello, this is Chris Hamilton at Porsche Motors. I'm either away from my desk or with a customer right now. But if you leave a name and number... There's a new way to quit smoking. Take a good look. You may never see it again. Introducing Clear Nicoderm CQ. For relieving tough nicotine cravings 24 hours a day, Clear's every bit as effective as the original CQ. But it's a more private way to quit. There's something different about you. Yes, there is. Clear Nicoderm CQ. Want a clear shot at quitting? Well, here's your window of opportunity. BNP Paribas. A highly diversified bank with worldwide presence and local market expertise gives investors access to global markets. Discover BNP Paribas, a new force in corporate and investment banking. The Lakers, the Pacers, in a hard-nosed game two, Shaq came up big again, leading L.A. to victory with 40 points. But now Larry Bird's Pacers are back home again in Indiana in front of their loud home crowd. 
crucial Game 3 of the NBA Finals, Sunday night, 7 Eastern, 4 Pacific, NBC. Now, Conchita Martinez, during this changeover, has called out WTA Tour trainer Sue Fleshman, and it appears that Martinez has something in her right eye. And the chair has now called for a three-minute injury timeout to allow that problem to be dealt with. So while they do, it's going to give us a chance to check in with Bud Collins, who, of course, is here at Court San Prowl during this match. But during the week, it's been floating all throughout this wonderful city to bring you today's Bud Facts. Bud Faxes, brought to you by Nike. Place de la Concorde. Gene Kelly danced so brilliantly around the fountains. But in an earlier grimmer time, this was the site of public executions. The guillotine was here. Heads rolled. But now the only thing that rolls is La Grand Rue, the big wheel, this marvelous Ferris wheel, here to celebrate the millennium, two years only. The Eiffel Tower, of course, is an old, old standby in Paris. A stand-up monument. But this new Ferris wheel, to me, is the best high in town. It rises almost 200 feet, and I've been a Ferris wheel fan since I was a boy. My first one, the Cuyahoga County Fair in Brea, Ohio, which was nice. That was fun. But this is Paris. You saw a lot then, but you see everything now. Ernest Hemingway wrote a book called The Movable Feast about his days in Paris. Well, this is a movable feast, too. Up and down over the town. You can see it all, the Champs-Élysées to the Arc de Triomphe. Butte de Montmartre, Sacre Coeur shining up there. The Cathedral of Notre Dame, Musée d'Orsay, the Louvre. It's all here. And then presto, the city of light never had so much light. The Eiffel Tower becomes the world's largest sparkler at night for the millennium. I'm glad I don't have to pay the electric bill. C'est Pete Sampras. Agassi. Now, Pete Sampras is my favorite player. Sampras. Pete. Agassi. Maybe Pete Sampras. André Agassi. Oh, he's lovely. I think Sampras. Sampras can't beat him. André. No. Pete. André. Pete Sampras. A giant amongst men. Go on, André! Talking great forehand. Dwack. Agassi. Agassi. Sampras. The smash! Oh, there! André! He's a winner. He's a tosser. I don't know, but I'd scream. André! Pete! Drive! Uh, is there a third option? Play ready to resume in the women's championship on Port St. Prowl. And our athletic trivia question for today, who has won the most men's singles titles in French Open history? He thinks it's Mr. McEnroe's friend. Answer to come. Well, Conchita Martinez ready to play again, although still swiping at that bothersome right eye. But she needs all of her focus now as Pierce serves a 3-4 second set. The problem with the eye first bothered Martinez when she was serving. Paused for quite a while between a first and a second serve in her last game. And Eventually, during the changeover and the injury timeout, she received an eye wash that seems to have cleared the problem. <laughs> Lost control of that backhand. Here's the 30 left. Well, in the first set, Mary Pierce only lost three points in the entire set on her serve, but she's been broken twice in this set. Just too short there, and Mary pouncing once again. Depth is critical for Martinez, because she doesn't put a lot on it. it makes it a whole lot tougher to hit winners. That ball's closer to the baseline. Oh. Like that shot. I guess we should point out that last year we showed this earlier that Martinez dropped the first set to Mary here at the French. 
for rebounding wing, 6'3", 6 6'3". 3, 6 3. Once again, hurting Pierce. That match last year that John referred to was in the second round. And then another clay court match a few months before that. Martinez down 6-3, 1762. But you better believe she'll keep competing. Now that ball too short, and Pierce once again steps in and rips the winner. So it's four all second set. He's man's best friend. Always there when you need him. Faithful to the end. So it's good to know that if you don't keep up with internet technology, Someone will still be there for you. When was the last time you felt 284 horses tugging at your soul? When was the last time you immersed yourself in hand-tufted virgin leather? Can you really put a price on this kind of perfection? Actually, you can because this $70,000 car could cost you over $326,000 in retirement savings. We just thought you should know. Ask a financial advisor about Sun America, the retirement specialist. Hey, back on your feet after all that work you missed. Yeah, good thing my supplemental insurance kicked in. Supple what? Ah, flat. Well, even the best health insurance doesn't give you cash to cover things like lost pay or other expenses. This does. What does? Ah, flat. Oh, sorry, buddy. What? Anyway, ask about it at work. <clears throat> Aflac. Without it, no insurance is complete. Ask about what? Aflac! Then Conchita Martinez knows uh, of her history with Mary Pierce, that she has had some comebacks. And she's done today, John, what, for example, Franco Scolari could never do yesterday. She's gotten herself straight. She's back in the set. Well, one thing, she's been there before. Scolari has never been anywhere near a Grand Slam semi. Conchita Wimbledon winner, three-time semifinalist here as well. Boy, I love that backhand, Mary. The short backswing. All right, the Affleck trivia question. And the survey says... Indeed, John's good friend and... Uh, seniors partner now, Bjorn Borg. Career record, 49-2. I think everyone is so looking forward to you and Bjorn Borg, your upcoming match at the Palace during Wimbledon. <laughs> That's when you know you've come back a long way at, over July 2nd at Wimbledon. There's Bjorn at six, a couple Frenchmen from the 20s, Cochet Lacoste, Mats V. Lander, Mr. Lendl, three each. <laughs> Saying you and Bjorn Borg going to play a match during the uh, Wimbledon fortnight at Buckingham Palace. And the rumor is not true. The queen will not be the umpire. <laughs> now, Conchita Martinez used to dream of winning the French Open. Did you dream as a little kid in Douglaston that you wanted to play a match at Buckingham Palace? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I dream now of winning the French Open. <laughs> Yet effective. Turns those hips, takes the ball in the rise, steps forward, whacks another backhand. Conchita unable to return it, and she's only six points away here from winning this French Open. 30 all, four all, second set. I didn't know Buckingham Palace had a tennis court until recently. <laughs> A 
real surprise is that Borg has paid him to make it red clay. <laughs> well, Conchita winning a point there she needed. The Porsche serve speed not, uh, not really relevant to Martinez today. Very rarely is cracked 85 to 90 miles an hour. Proving he can win points without the big All the more amazing that she won Wimbledon, her one mm -hmm. slam title. by Conchita Martinez, and she holds for 5-4. Surprisingly, we measure success a little differently. Chris was like my shadow. She was always there. For three years, she'd drive down from her job at Kraft to tutor me. She'd be there tutoring for two hours. You know, reading, math, social studies. She was all over everything. My grades went way up. The Philip Morris companies, including Kraft Foods, give back to our communities through corporate contributions and volunteerism. She was cool. How many tutors do you know who will stick with a person for that long time? In the last 40 years, Philip Morris has given hundreds of millions of dollars to programs, like Chicago's Off the Street Club, that make a difference in people's lives. When she left to have a baby, I told her I hoped she'd have a daughter. She already did a great job helping to raise a son. A difference. The people of Philip Morris. Thirty contenders, three continents, one winner. The new Lincoln LS. Motor Trend Car of the Year. Colin Montgomery, emotional and keenly competitive. He's Europe's best. Now he goes for his first major title, the U.S. Open, beginning Thursday on NBC. Mary Pierce trying to do something that hasn't been done in over three decades. A French woman winning the French Open. The last one, Francoise Darren, Bud Collins is with her. Well, you thought you'd never see this woman, but 33 years ago, Francoise Dour did indeed win the title. And did you live to think you'd see another Frenchman? And will she? I hope I will see it pretty soon. Uh, Maria has been playing quite well the whole week, so I hope she can do it now. Well, you've been the head, the national captain for the French, and I know she had a little difficulty when she first started to play for the French. Has that all been ironed out? Yes, I think she has. She, she, she won the Fed Cup for France. She was in a winning team with us, so uh, I think uh, she will do it again. Well, Francoise, you've held this record a long time. Will it be nice to share it? I hope so, because my shoulders are very heavy after 33 years. <laughs> Merci. Francoise Dour, the champion in 1967. <laughs> uh, Mary Pierce, as you could hear in the beautiful accent of Francoise Dur, when the crowd will cheer for her, it's Marie, Mary to us in America. Now serving at 4-5, second set. Second ago, she's six points away from winning the title. Now, Martinez wins this game. They're level. Look at the sense that this has been a level match. So, tremendous for Conchita to get herself right back in here. Oh, well, it's just long. Zero. I got to point out, though, for you Martinez fans, that she's had some excellent results on hard courts, too. I mean, I see here two-time Australian semifinalist, a finalist there in 98, a couple times in the semis of the 
United States Open. Easy put away from Mary there. She won Wimbledon in 94. She's been in two other semifinals as well at Wimbledon. Mary Pierce showing some nice prowess at net. Sure likes to swing at those volleys, but she's had a lot of success. 30 love. Mary hit a shot, just sort of expected Conchita not even to get there. This is later in the point. Wide open court. Conchita Martinez desperately out of it, but yet it's Mary who misses the forehand. That's where the hard work pays off. Make your opponent hit one more shot. Once again, showing some nice intelligence. Knows Get Conchita on. Martinez is, is probably a little winded, so she goes for the angle. And look what she's doing, John. She's going right to the line to serve, and Conchita's walking. Absolutely correct. She's looking to rush Conchita right now. back on touch with her serve and it's five all second set you still care as much as when you started this job care i'm a paramedic i get thick skin and just when you think nothing can get to you anymore you see a kid who's hurt real bad or a man having a heart attack in front of his two kids do i care as much as when i started I care more the best players in women's tennis are coming to town for the Acura Classic, July 29th through August 6th at La Costa Resort and Spa. Martina Hingis, Anna Kornikova, Lindsay Davenport, Venus Williams, Monica Sellis, Mary Pierce. The Acura Classic. For ticket information, call 760-438-5683 or Ticketmaster today. Thing better than being here is being here. Ninety-seven days to Olympics 2000 on NBC 739. The French Open is brought to you by Agilent Technologies, dreams made real, by Lotrimin AF, the number one recommendation of doctors, and by Porsche. Sometimes, John, players like Conchita Martinez, the longer you let them hang around in a match, the more dangerous they become. Well, just ask Sugiyama and Kara Black, for starters, this Ben alone, who won the first set and were eventually defeated by Martinez. But right now, Mary Pierce starting to get a little more of the support of this crowd that was so emphatic in her wins over Sellis and Hing. It's been a little, I think, a little more restrained today. First of all, they wanted to win, but they also want to see a decent match. We wanted to be 6-2, 6-0. This has become competitive. She needed the fans more against Sellis and Hingis. Better players, with all due respect to Martinez. But now they're about ready, I think, to put this one away for her. And Mary responds there. Nice backhand. Well, I, I, I also say this once a day, that go behind your opponent on this surface. Tough to come back and go the other way. Johnson. All right, game three, Pacers and Lakers tomorrow night, 7 Eastern, 4 Pacific. It starts with NBA Showtime.
we were buzzing here this morning. We get our information from msnbcsports.com. 39 free throws by Shaq <laughs> in one game. <laughs> that compact back and again not much of the backswing but perfectly timed steps in on the rise and on top of that just the angle she was looking for see I was always taught as you move in closer that you see the ball from a different place and 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 therefore your angles better you're closer to the net and so it's like trying to solve a math problem makes things easier Martinez is working awfully hard, way behind that baseline. Oh, that reminded me a lot of Guillermo Vilas, that passing shot. It just, it just hurts to watch because She's running around, Mary's in position at this point, hits this overhead, and it's the one that's way above your shoulder. You just have to sit there and watch what seems like hours before it comes down and drops well inside the baseline. Crowd also responding because they're seeing much better tennis. Conchita Martinez excited back in the second very set. Very exciting second set. First set was over in a hurry. There it is again. You can see almost nothing on the serve. And she's just hoping for some good placement at this point. This is throw it up to start the point. He doesn't expect to win any freebies. She just wants to make sure she's not hurt by the return of serve. Right on the line. And there's the first visible emotion from Mary Pierce. Well, it's her turn to hustle this point because Martinez had her on a rope and she was the one that had to sit and watch this. Smack on the line. She knows what one break could mean here. <laughs> and she knows, Mary Pierce does, how difficult it was and how everyone agonized with her trying to close out Hingis. her chance to break. Well, gets the break here with the light card. Martinez able to hit this ball deep with no pace on it. Mary New just hit a good solid pass. Low part of the net. Now break point. Five points away. Next to Yannick Pierce, brother David, who's been coaching Mary the last three months. championship. Their eyes locked. He began to kiss her. Suddenly she pushed him away. What is wrong? He asked. Oh, Nick. 
My portfolio is totally unbalanced. Three of my mutual funds are underperforming. And I've been far too concentrated in small cap stocks. You can always tell an investor who's had a Schwab portfolio consultation. It's an objective evaluation that tells you how you're doing and whether you could do better. She spun around. If you don't understand portfolio allocation, Nick, you don't understand me. Wait, I love you. Time now for some game analysis presented by Charles Schwab. Let's see what we're going to. Where's this Allies. outfit now? <laughs> this is Helen Wills Moody, one of the greats <laughs> back in the 20s. Now I know where Martinez got her, her serve from. Oh, she get that ball up there a little bit. Actually, this is, yeah, this, she's got it way up there. You know, in the old days, you weren't allowed to jump off the ground, so I wanted to fell defend Helen Wills there. And our vintage film footage provided by the Video Kings of the Court.com. Well, Mary Pierce, with such an incredible life behind her, just in the last six months, she's had a mild renewal of her relationship with her father. That is Mother Yannick on the right. Not Brother David on the left. Brother David is coaching in another yes, portion of the Court Central. And now Mary Pierce has a chance to cap it all off as she serves for a French Open championship. Ball! Oh! Maybe the worst game that Mary Pierce has played in this entire two weeks, John, was the game that she served for the match in the second set against Hayes. Well, what's Thursday. the toughest game to win? Guess what? Right now to win her first French Open title. You better believe that the nerves are working big time. She's trying to regain her composure here at Love 15, missing that just long. <laughs> Arms get heavier, toss starts dropping, legs suddenly feel weary. The swinging volleys aren't very effective. Gave Martinez plenty of time to line this up, this line up this forehand pass, and that's the half lob, half passing shot once again. Now you know why she broke the previous game, because she got broken, she wouldn't lose a set. time the lock too short. Dance. And from that area, Mary's not going to have a problem with that. Martinez moving her into net, so she says, all right. Deep backhand causes the error. Now two, just two points away. How good does that feel? There's Francois. Settle down. Paris that is ready to celebrate championship point. S'il vous plaît.
Merci. Merci. That was a 14,000 person sigh. Save for the Spaniards, the brave souls here cheering on Conchita. Martinez can see renewed life. A point here to get the set to a tiebreak. failed. Mary has used those angles very, very nice, and Conchita just doesn't like moving forward. It's just not in her nature. She looked to approach the net, but missed a pretty easy approach. serving her second championship point. Les joueurs sont prêts. Merci. Just wide. take that surprise miss from Martinez third match point you talk about a game face well she went from being calm and you know the attempted smile to like let's get this over with enough's enough s'il vous plaît 
looks could kill, Martinez will miss this return. celebrated and danced with the crowd here on Port Central. France can cheer one of theirs. Not since Francoise Der 33 years ago has someone playing under the French flag captured this championship. Well, the serve. Big one was what she needed there, and Martinez did miss the return. And, you know, last year, Ted, we talked with Agassi and all the tough times he'd been through, and I think it makes all the more sweeter for Mary that she, after all her struggles here and getting to the final six years ago, losing, coming back, and what a moment for her. A life story that the public knows more than Mary Pierce would like them to know. A complicated story. Born in Canada, raised and lives still in the United States, but plays under the French flag and now her second Grand Slam championship and the one in her adopted homeland. And with the eyes of the nation watching, Mary Pierce today delivered the goods. Cheetah Martinez, yes, disappointment. Not knowing if at age 28 there'll be another opportunity. But Cheetah Martinez for the magnificent two week run here. Coming up, the trophy presentation will speak with both participants and a preview of tomorrow's men's final, all when we return to Roman Garros on NBC. BNP Paribas. A highly diversified bank with worldwide presence and local market expertise gives investors access to global markets. Discover BNP Paribas, a new force in corporate and investment banking. A mere flicker. Once, that was all the hope that remained for the tiger. And while this species is still one of the world's most endangered, hands from all ends of the earth have begun to kindle the fire and breathe life into her flame. We at ExxonMobil are proud to play a part in this global effort to help keep the tiger's fire burning brightly. To find out how you can make a difference, call 1-800-5-TIGERS. Leather, adrenaline, the new Lincoln LS, Motor Trend Car of the Year. Hello, Mark John Jeffries here. Believe it or not, for less than the price of a cup of coffee or hot chocolate, People PC can give you a brand new computer and unlimited internet access. But what if I need help at 2 in the morning? Rest assured, People PC is awake and at the ready. So for as little as 82 cents a day, it really does make a lot of sense to call. Call People PC now. 1-800-PEOPLE-PC. BNP Paribas, a highly diversified bank with worldwide presence and local market expertise, gives investors access to global markets. Discover BNP Paribas, a new force in corporate and investment banking. 
Sunday, Lisa Leslie leads the L.A. Sparks against league MVP Yolanda Griffith and the Sacramento Monarchs. The WNBA on NBC, Sunday at 3 Eastern. Port Central at Roland Garros. A moment the French have waited 33 years for. A women's champion, Mary Pierce, who's played the last 10 years under the French flag, receiving the Coupe Suzanne Lanlan. From Christian Beams, the president of the French Federation of Tennis, and also from great champions Martina Navratilova and Francoise Durr, who can stand up straighter now. <laughs> the weight is off her shoulders. How good does this feel? Mary Pierce turned to France when she had no other option, when she had no funding. Her mother, French born, in the French Federation of Tennis 10 years ago, March of 1990, she provided the funding, and she has played a decade now under their flag. The dream will have to wait for Conchita Martinez. She said she had spent the last six weeks dreaming of winning the French Open. She came closer than she ever has. 13th time, makes it all the way to the finals. Tremendous effort for, that, for this veteran. Tremendous clay court player. And Conchita Martinez has proven that she's not through with tennis. She will wake up Monday morning ranked fourth in the world. And now Mary Pierce, who has spoken French since the age of 13. Okay. Je me souviens la dernière fois quand j'ai été ici il y a quatre ans. J'ai perdu en finale et puis euh, plein de choses se sont passées les, euh, ces six dernières années, beaucoup de choses. Et je pense que je ne vais jamais, jamais oublier ce jour aujourd'hui. C'était vraiment fabuleux. Je, je veux vous remercier tous. Merci. saying she remembers the last time she was here in the final and lost. Six years later, she said she came back and she won. Before the final six years ago, she didn't sleep much that night, thinking about having to make a victory speech in French. Didn't happen. Well, I doubt she slept a whole lot last night either. But... Merci, je vous aime aussi. <laughs> she also went on to say her dream has come true today. She never thought that she would be able to win here one day. There an acknowledgement of Conchita Martinez. C'était un match uh, très difficile pour moi aujourd'hui, surtout le deuxième set. C'était très très accroché et puis si uh, c'est allé dans trois sets, on ne sait jamais. Elle a très bien joué aujourd'hui et puis uh, je suis contente d'avoir gagné aujourd'hui et puis je vais revenir l'année prochaine et je vous attends tous l'année prochaine et uh, j'espère de faire encore la même chose pour vous. Merci tous les sponsors. Euh, les... Oui, bien sûr, sans les sponsors, on n'a pas de tournoi. No sponsor, thanks. C'est vraiment sur les masses de balles, merci. She said uh, that she especially found the second set hard, not surprising, and she said she will Et come back next year. Et tout le monde qui m'a aidé pendant cette, cette uh, quinzaine, toute ma famille. Don't forget to thank the fans, because they helped. And, uh, acknowledgement of her mother and her brother. Merci pour tout. Merci d'être là avec moi.